Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel e-commerce project tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about show orders for admin. So let's see how can we show the orders uh, inside the admin panel. For that, switch to the project and just go inside the admin controller. So uh, go here app directory and HTTP controllers and let's let's open admin controller and inside this controller let's create a new function here so right here public function and function name orders and inside this orders uh, let's page uh, all orders okay so right here orders variable is equal to order model name okay then Order colon colon uh, order by created underscore add and let's fetch the record descending order okay by date so right here desc and then call the paginate method paginate okay and inside the paginate just pass here the default value. 12 and also import this order model okay so here on the top of the page just right here copy this and paste order okay and now uh, return view and just return a view admin dot orders okay and also pass the orders so later compact and inside this just pass here the order okay now save this and now let's create the route for this so go to the web.php resource routes web.php and inside the admin route group uh, just add here a new route route and get method and pass here the URI admin slash orders okay then controller name which is admin controller colon colon plus and method name method name is orders okay this one orders and give the route name admin dot orders okay now save this and now let's create this view so go to the resources directory views then admin folder and here let's create a new view orders dot blade.php okay and now uh, add here the layout so it stains layout name layouts dot admin and uh, and here the section, section name contained okay and now close this in section and now go to the template directory and from admin folder let's open the orders.html file in text editor so open with visual studio code and let's copy the main okay this one main div and first of all have this div copy select copy and paste inside the section and now here let's change the dashboard link so right here route admin dot index okay admin dot index and now inside this table and let's display here the order so inside the t body we stand here for this directive for h dollar orders orders as dollar order and now cut this in for each and paste after this closing tier 
and now display here the order ID so right here dollar dollar order add ID and uh, name mobile number order stable okay there is the name and phone number okay so right here phone And now display here the subtotal tags total okay change here the name subtotal tags total and uh, order status so the status and uh, order date so just display here the created created at okay and then the status order date total items so this thing on the total item just right here dollar order arrow order items arrow count okay and uh, uh, here uh, let's display the delivery date so right here order arrow delivery date deliver date okay what is the column name this one delivered it okay also copy the class name this one and uh, paste inside this td okay now here let's show the pagination pagination link so right here double curly bracket dollar orders arrow link and links and inside this just pass here the parameter pagination column column bootstrap dash file now save this now it's done uh, do one more thing uh, let's add a link inside the layout file so go to the admin layout file layouts admin dot play dot php file and inside the orders link here is the orders link okay so just remove this and add here route and uh, route name which is admin admin dot orders okay now save this and let's check so switch to the browser and uh, let's log in with the admin credential so right here this one login click here now go to the orders page click on orders link okay uh, undefined variable order okay just pass here the orders not order so inside the admin controller just right here this one orders okay now we press the page and you can see here the orders okay inside this order there are three items second order two item and first order two item 
all right uh, in next video you can uh, we will see how can uh, display the order details okay so in this way you can so orders for admin so that's all about showing orders for admin so thanks for watching this video don't forget to subscribe my channel uh, thanks for watching